the Honourable Member for Edmonton Strathcona. Thank you, Madam Speaker, and I would like to thank my colleague for his, his intervention today. Uh, he started off today talking about how much these, these steps that the government has taken to help Canadians has cost. And, and, and I agree with him. What I, what I disagree with him on is the fact that, you know, New Democrats will always, will always say that we should be supporting Canadians to get through this pandemic. Uh, we should continue to support Canadians as this pandemic continues to carry on. Um, one of the things that I do struggle with, though, is that he voted against, his party voted with the government, with the Liberals, against a wealth tax. So to make revenue, to have that be more balanced, why did he vote with the Liberals? Why did the Conservatives stand with the Liberals again against a wealth tax? Yeah. The Honourable Member for Hal uh, Halliburton, Kawatha Lakes Brock. Thank you very much, Madam Speaker. I appreciate the question from the uh, member opposite. I do appreciate work on committees that we have had on before and the contribution uh, that member makes. It is greatly appreciated, and I have learned a lot from her. Um, I, I would say this. Uh, government doesn't have a, a revenue problem. It has a spending problem, Speaker. I would say the government is spending more than it ever has. But what is actually going right at this exact moment? There's a massive housing bubble. Inflation is at a 20-plus year high. Veterans are still waiting in line for their services. Indigenous communities are still waiting for their clean water. We need to see results from this government. Increased spending is not a badge of honour if you don't get the results that follow.